For colonoscopy, the first part of it is, is that there is preparation involved. You need to cleanse the bowel so when you do do the exam, you can see things adequately and, and very well. So the day before the test usually involves a special diet, clear liquid diet, and then a uh, liquid solution that's a purgative agent that cleanses the bowel. The day of the procedure, uh, you have nothing to eat or drink that day, typically, or at least for four to six hours prior to the uh, exam being performed. Uh, the test itself involves preparation the day of the procedure, so you have to uh, present yourself to the endoscopy uh, suite. Uh, an IV is placed uh, so that we can administer medications and fluids intravenously to sedate you and relieve any discomfort that you might otherwise experience during the procedure. The test itself is actually a small portion of all the preparation and, and things that go on to get ready for the test. Typically a colonoscopy exam by a qualified uh, person who's experienced in the exam takes only uh, 20 to 30 minutes. That would be pretty typical for a colonoscopy exam. And that involves sedating the patient so they're comfortable and relaxed, kind of a bit of a twilight zone. It's called conscious sedation. You're not out like you would be for a, an abdominal surgery like an appendectomy or, or gallbladder removal, but you're very comfortable and the majority of people don't remember very much, if anything, of the actual procedure.